Now till now we have studied about the line, intersecting line, collinear points, coplanar points, distance between two parallel lines, distance between skew lines. Now we will learn about plane. Plane is that which contain lines. So as we know, three distinct non collinear points determine unique plane that means maybe x y y z z x plane so there is always a unique plane containing two parallel lines that is there is always a unique plane containing two intersecting lines that is a plane may consist two parallel lines or two intersecting lines so now we are going to find plane through three distinct non collinear point that is suppose point a with position vector a point b with position vector b and point c with position vector c are three non collinear points in r cube therefore a b c determine unique plane Say pi. Let p point be position vector r be any point in plane pi such that p is not equal to a. That is different from a. Thus. A P, A B, A C are coplanar. That is as by the concept of coplanar, a vector is a linear combination of other two vector. That is, we say A P. is a linear combination of ab and ac that is there exists mn belongs to real number 
and m square plus n square is not equal to zero such that AP is equal to M times AB plus N times AC. Now, by the rule of position vector, AP is vector R minus A, M times vector B minus A, N times vector C minus A. If M is equal to N is equal to 0, then vector r is equal to vector a and a point with position vector a belongs to pi plane that is in any case equation of plane is Vector R is equal to vector A plus M times B minus A plus N times C minus A for M comma N belongs to R. Now converse if P of R satisfies R minus A is equal to M times B minus A plus N times C minus A for all M comma N belongs to R and M square plus N square is not equal to 0 then we can write AP is equal to M times AB plus n times ac that is ab is in the plane of ab and ac that is as a is in pi plane that implies P is in pi plane. As in the above part we prove that as P in pi plane it implies A in pi plane. So it is a converse as A in pi plane so P is in also pi plane. Also if m is equal to n is equal to 0 then vector r is equal to vector a it is also true as a and p lie in same plane that is p is equal to a belongs to pi plane therefore p of r belongs to pi if and only if R satisfies vector R is equal to vector A plus M times vector B minus A plus N times vector C minus A and therefore the plane pi determined by point A, B and C has the equation that is vector R is equal to 1 minus M minus N vector A plus M times B plus N times C. That is we can say that let this is L, L times A plus M times B 
plus n times c where 1 minus m minus n is equal to l that implies l plus m plus n is equal to 1 so this is the vector equation of the plane containing three distinct non collinear points A with position vector A, B with position vector B and C with position vector C. So this is the required vector equation of a plane. Now we have to find parametric equation of a plane. That is, let P of X, Y, Z be any point of the plane passing through non-collinear point A with coordinate x1, y1, z1 with B x2, y2, z2 and C with coordinate x3, y3, z3 and as we have vector equation of plane is Vector R is equal to L times A, M times B, plus N times C. Then we get by substituting coordinate of A, B, C and R. That is we get X, Y, Z is equal to L times X1, Y1, Z1, M times X2 y2 z2 plus n times x3 y3 z3 so on comparing the respective coefficient we get x is equal to l times x1 m times x2 n times x3 And the next y is equal to L times y1 plus M times y2 plus N times y3. And Z component is LZ1 MZ2 plus NZ3 where L, M, N belongs to real number with the property L plus M plus N is equal to 1 are the parametric equation of the plane through A, B and C and L, M, N 
are the parameters. So these were the case of parametric equation of a plane. Now we are going to find another form of vector equation of a plane. If point A with position vector A, point B with position vector B, point C with position vector C are three non collinear distinct points, then they determine a unique plane pi and if p of r belongs to pi if and only if vector ap vector ab vector ac are Coplanar, that is R minus A, B minus A, position vector of AB, C minus A, position vector of AC are coplanar. And we know three vectors are coplanar when their scalar triple product is zero. That is if and only if R minus A dot product with B minus A cross product with C minus A that is scalar triple product of AP, AB and AC is 0. Also if vector R is equal to A that gives vector R minus A is equal to 0. That is result R minus A dot product with B minus A cross product with C minus A is also true in this case. That is P of R belongs to pi in this case also. So thus the vector equation of the plane through distinct non collinear points. A, B and C is scalar triple product of R minus A, B minus A, C minus A should be equal to 0. Then we get the required vector equation of a plane.